are seeing what's left behind from that bus fire here. Broken glass and the roof burns completely. Even on the inside, you can see burned seats and ash where the children once were. I heard some kids screaming and I looked out the window and all I saw was the bus on fire. Rosie Jean and David Porter saw this school bus engulfed in flames and managed to record it all on their cell phone. You could feel the heat from across the street, so we had no idea if they were still on there or off there. The bus was carrying 56 students to take to four different schools in Spartanburg County. School officials tell us that two students seated in the back of the bus told the bus driver they smelled smoke. I was expecting to see just a little bit of char on the back of the bus. When I pulled up on the scene and saw this, my heart dropped. After students alerted the bus driver, she sprang into action to get the kids to safety. She did exactly what she had been trained to do in terms of evacuating those students and looking out for their safety. The bus driver, Teresa Strobel, managed to get all 56 students off the bus and down South Moore Street in Duncan to safety. She evacuated those 56 students in less than a minute. Teresa Strobel is being called a hero for her actions and has served as a bus driver for 10 years to date. In Duncan, Aubrey Jackson, WYFF News 4.